more than 90 percent students who invest six months one year in coaching are not able to qualify in gate but truth be told one can easily qualify in gate with just five days of right work in aptitude and two weeks of right work in math and one can achieve this without investing any money and this video is master class for getting 15 out of 15 in gate aptitude hi i'm raguram and i'm tech alumni of iit madras in this video i'll share you the best resources free and paid the sure sure topics the preparation strategy to master gate aptitude now when it comes to gate aptitude resources one can get the best resources at free of cost how to get that if you look at the overall scenario of gate one side more than 90 percent coaching students get disqualified other side we see coaching students persistent for one or two or even three years to get a but there is a minority of group who not simply cracks gate but also a topper in their first term in that group there is a minority who cracks gate in less than six months and there are some rare people like aditya who did btech in one stream and cracks gate in other stream in six months everything was new to me i didn't know anything about it. and when i asked him how he prepared aptitude you just solved the pre previous questions of your branch or me okay. was gate cs and then i also solved some other gate paper pyqs as well so you are done with aptitude that is the point to effectively learn aptitude in a shorter duration we don't need to read book books with big explanation then solve practice problems and then pyqs we just need good concise content and we need pyqs that's all in description i have added the best playlist to study and links for website where you can get pyqs for free and a honorable mention for oshol books 15 years all topic wise and chapter wise pyq aptitude book where they not only share the previous year questions but also the this booklet comprehensively discusses all the concepts in aptitude this is actually an all in one booklet i would highly recommend it additionally they have included mind maps mnemonics for better understanding and memory i had attached the links for these book in the description do check it out they had one for aptitude and one for maths now step 1 don't study like ar1 when i look at the toppers who got ar1 who my get inspired a lot one thing i observed while watching their interviews is often these students make mistakes in first attempt and then they rectify it in their upcoming attempt but when we look at the toppers like aditya he cracked gate in his first attempt that to in 6 months one thing i learned new from him is i didn't know anything about the gate exam so i okay. started researching i got to know there are subjects like aptitude engineering maths and there are a lot of subjects like 10 to 12 subject and then okay. i saw some videos on youtube like what is the syllabus of marks of each subject the weightage and when is the exam and how okay. to study the which are the core subjects which are the easier subjects i, I researched about everything so the first step is to understand everything about the task before jumping into the task that's what we are going to do first we will understand everything about aptitude in detail then we are going to prepare first get aptitude irrespective of any stream 15 marks guaranteed out of it 5 one marks and 5 two marks the syllabus contains four sections quants numerical verbal and spatial weightage for each section there is no clear pattern on weightage of each topics but out of all the topics here are some topic that most frequently come take a screenshot of it and it's best not to attempt the exam without studying these and if you are looking split up of aptitude topics from foundation to advanced here it take a screenshot of it like the column 1 is base then column 2 is little advanced then to advanced step 2 the strategy this is ram balaji in his final year he got all in the rank 1 he won iit madras gold medalist also placed at texas instrument i was wondering how he was at his peak in all the areas without compromising on any area and the main secret lies on how he allocates time and the way he works on these goals so when actually i had one question like when you were placement and gate which you gave first priority at each point of time we need to give priority to one One thing when i had my uh, institute exams i gave priority to exam so when i had my placements i gave priority to placements Place. and once placement was done then i gave priority to gate okay. and this type of work as mentioned by cal newport called deep work it simply means we block certain time and we intensely focus on only that task and deep work is the core concept of our strategy So first we are going to block 5 full days for aptitude but be flexible if you can finish the required aptitude tasks of the day feel free to study other subjects like giving priorities i used to do most of the time that work yeah, whichever yeah. is in the number 1 priority number one, then correct. like whenever i find some free time i used to do correct, then correct. other out of that in the first 3 to 4 days we will cover the complete aptitude syllabus means understanding concepts in each topic and practice 2 to 3 problems to get clarity of the concept conceptual clarity is very important here is the split up of approximate time required for each section and spatial we don't need much effort but while practicing we'll focus more on this and in the last 1 to 2 days of 5 days take the pyqs of your stream just solve one year by one ideally try to solve 15 years of pyqs now we are clear in gate aptitude syllabus but the problem is by the time i'm shooting this video gate exam is approximately 2 months from now and we need to retain this concept till then and it's best not try just to survive but 
we should try to thrive by february we should be able to solve apti foster and accurate like jaydeep panwar now jaydeep panwar he got get ar1 2021 in cs he finished gate in just one hour 30 minutes in my final exam of the gate i finished my paper in one and a half hours i asked them can i leave they said no okay since this video is specific for aptitude by the time of gate we must be able to solve apti foster and accurate and how can we do that step 3 be ambitious two things we need to do first is practice every day after the fifth day invest 30 to 45 minutes ideally first 30 to 45 minutes in morning take one pvq paper of other stream and solve it and do it till gate and while solving solve in a test taking condition as barbara oakley mentioned in mind for numbers book if you compare how much you learn by spending one hour studying versus one hour taking a test on the same material you will retain and learn far more as a result of the hour you spend taking a test and when you make a mistake it's fine if it's the first time but mistakes shouldn't be repeated twice so make sure note the mistakes in a different color in the booklet or if you had taken short notes note it there and along with pvqs on certain days give aptitude tests from your gate test series second don't use virtual calculator practically speaking doing the calculations in gate virtual calculator is the slowest compared to all the calculators that ever exist in this planet sumit bambu an iit bombay graduate gate ar1 2019 unlike other gate ar1 he not just work harder he also works smart which is he finds way to minimize the use of virtual calculator he constantly find shortcuts frequent calculations and aptitude is an area where we can learn more tricks so do it and use virtual calculator only when it is required but most importantly while practicing use only virtual calculator instead of casio because it takes time to adapt with the interface i see the light from far away it's down the line maybe i should not give up without a fight